If a media giant were to use your trademarked catchphrase without permission, would you choose to sue? I knew immediately that it was a problem for us. For Waitsfield-based publisher Choose Co, suing Netflix was a no-brainer. Probably about 12 minutes after it launched, I started hearing from people saying to me, you need to stop what you're doing, you need to watch this immediately. Bandersnatch, based on the book. The video series is called Black Mirror Bandersnatch. The viewer makes a series of choices that ultimately decide the ending. Well, I can't be a great writer. You're always flicking backwards and forwards and that. No, it's a choose your own adventure book. The core of the publisher's problem lies within the use of the term choose your own adventure. It's trademarked by the Vermont company that's written more than 100 books using the phrase. For this choice, you could pick to go to the Space Academy or explore the knowledge within yourself. Depending which option you choose, going to command school or the research program, determines how the story ends. And if you had picked command school, you would have reached the end. Chusco was suing Netflix for $25 million, claiming its use of the catchphrase is causing confusion, tarnishing, denigrating, and diluting the quality of the trademark. For example, the 15-page lawsuit goes on to say that, depending on the choices the Netflix viewer makes, it can include references to and depictions of a demonic presence, violent fighting, drug use, murder, mutilation of a corpse, decapitation, and other upsetting imagery. Endings that the publisher says would never appear in its children's books. We try really hard to keep things age appropriate for the audience that we're aiming for. Chusco says its focus will remain on writing its choose your own adventure books. How about you decide what you want for your breakfast? As it waits for Netflix to choose on which way it would like to proceed in court. In Waitsfield, Liz Strepa, NBC5 News. NBC5 did reach out to Netflix for comment about this lawsuit. We haven't heard back yet.